did you think they were gonna do? Smell like roses? No. That one's the fattest. That one's chubby. Yeah. And that one's bacon. Okay. So this one's the boy, the other one's the girl. What one? This one's the boy. So Mal, you have bacon the boy. Andrea, you have chubby the girl. <laughs> and she wants to eat your chickens. And the girl's got a belly rupture. That's what that round thing is on the bottom of the belly. What do you think, Biscuit? And the boy <laughs> They're the same size as her. I think they stink. <laughs> That's what Biscuit thinks. Biscuit thinks they stink. They're into making a mess, rooting their own already. Rooting shavings into their feed. It take them long to find their water. <clears throat> um, <laughs> the boy. They both found water before you got over here. Oh. So you're over it already? Call you back when they're already baking? <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember what kind of pigs they are? What breed they are? Normal white. Normal <laughs> pink. Normal pink pigs? The Yorkshire? Yorkshire. <laughs> Yorkshire. Hey, piggies, look at Bisky. Yeah, Bisky's not sure about them. <laughs> they made noise in the back of the truck and Biscuit was gone. Yep, that's about it. <laughs> the, one, the one snorted bad. <coughs> you need a big mess. Oh, you ain't seen nothing yet as far as mess. The one likes Biscuit. I don't need a muddy spot because they need mud, mud for sunscreen. Keep cool. Keep cool. Keep the bugs off them so they don't sunburn you. Well, no, it's being here for a couple of weeks till the weather gets better. Well, it looks like our new arrivals made it through the night. <coughs> they didn't get out. Seems to be working out all right. I was kind of worried about it leaking because I just threaded that in there. There's not, it's not very thick barrel. When we move them outside, I'll switch to a bigger barrel. But. And the male's gonna be a bully. I thought one of them was gonna go. 
dump the feed right away. Yeah. We've got a bigger feeder we're probably going to end up using. Because they don't hardly even get anything ate before they start flipping the feeder over here. Yeah, right. But that's our new arrivals. I look forward to watching them grow. <clears throat> Maybe by the end of July, they'll be bacon. We'll see how fast they grow. I've got them on 18%. The guy we got them from, they were on 20%. And they just got wormed. He thinks that's why they're a little loose. And they changed feed just before they, we got there. They added apples. Yeah, they added apples to the feed. And they'll get kitchen scraps here besides their non-GMO pig feed. I hope we bought enough feed to make them through. These two barrels are pretty much full. And then all them bags, except for that chick starter bag. So I'm hoping that's enough to get them through besides food scraps. And I got their pen tied right to this feed barrel and this water barrel so they can't move it around because they sure try to get out. Push their nose around underneath it. Come here, biscuit. Chicken. Are you chicken? Well, guys, we're going to put our pig feeder in with them. I wasn't going to put it in until we moved them outside because it's fairly big. But of course, pigs being pigs, they're flipping their other feed over and spilling it all over. So this has got a big heavy cast iron bottom and stainless steel. Picked it up at an auction a few years back. It was going really cheap. They were using it for a flower planter, whoever had it before. But I, th I don't think they'll be tipping this one over yet. So we're going to clean this up a little bit and I got to find a bolt or two for it and we'll put it in there they won't be able to tip this one over got little piggies Thank you. 
Yeah, probably because of the water. Okay. There, they got less space, but I ain't gonna be wasting as much feed. And it won't be long and they'll be outside anyway. Just gotta get the weather to stay straight and out for a while. Well, that's our new additions. Please like and subscribe if you want to keep watching them grow. It's one of the next things we're going to be doing is building our outside pen and building some kind of shelter for them. But see you next time.